Uh, well, our new neighborhood project uh, was funded in 2012. Three main elements of it. One, we had a community event. Uh, it was a sporting event to do a sort of community badminton tournament. Uh, the other elements were the education part as well. So we had people coming in for leading on from that. What we did is promote the project. We had uh, food and hygiene courses, first aid, basic computer courses, which was also available for community people to come in. We had the luncheon, a community luncheon that was really every two weeks we had that one one day every two weeks we had it uh, it wasn't really that popular but the education side the courses the food the food and hygiene and the first aid was brilliant we had a lot of people turn up for that the application was really straightforward and it's basic uh, basic application and it's being honest and direct what you want the funding for and how you're going to deliver it What I did for, for to engage different people from faith to community is it's just again publicity, we did a bit of publicity, I got in touch with our local vicar who helped me a lot as well, uh, he supported me through the process of funding as well, to get, uh, we, we set up uh, text messages, local media, we used the uh, social media network, so it was Facebook, uh, texting and uh, Twitter. Uh, and obviously our website and we set up leaflets for these uh, although because we were in a predominantly a Muslim area with a lot of Muslim community living uh, the turnout wasn't that was so it was more f majority was Muslims that participated in the event but we did have people from Christian faith uh, Hindu faith uh, Sikh faith participating in those events uh, which was brilliant it was the I think the togetherness of the community, we had a lot of volunteers participating, so we had a lot of volunteers coming in, uh, helping us with the event and activities. That really helped to use the funding wisely, actually, I think, reduce the costing of, of the paying for the things. Uh, a lot of uh, sponsors that helped us as well. The best uh, things were, were those education, using sports as a means for getting people to do other education or uh, to learn basic skills or gain uh, skills, gain qualifications that would help them in the future for employment or uh, so forth or other job prosperity. So Difficult and challenging what I found was our area has got it's thinking, and we have a lot of new communities coming in from Europe. Uh, it's engaging, there's new, new communities, uh, it's just very difficult. The other thing was uh, again getting more faith groups into into the project but I reckon that is because of the predominant area we're in it's only two major faith groups in those areas and that's what it was. We tried to expand it and go out a bit of an earning turn different areas to do it which had a bit of turn up but again it's just that uh, the main issue was engaging engaging the new communities other than that everything else was you know fine <laughs>